Aloha, I'm Rosin Steiner, president of Steiner Biotechnology. The purpose of this video is to introduce our latest contribution to the dental bone graft industry. After recognizing the need to modernize aging socket grafting technology, we have worked hard to develop revolutionary bone grafting solutions with three goals in mind. First, ease of application without preparation. Second, create a firm, stable, and packable bone graft that would control bleeding in the extraction socket. Our third and final goal is to maximize the osteogenic capacity of our technology to produce the quickest rate of bone regeneration available in today's market. Keeping with the Hawaiian heritage of our company, you can see our 1cc bone graft is provided in the shape of a plumeria flower with the bone graft forming the petals. The following is a practical demonstration of socket graft putty as it is applied to a model to show you the ease and speed of the process. Here we have a model that has been heated to mimic the oral cavity. Because the bone graft is applied frozen, throughout our development we discovered the graft material reduced inflammation and post-operative pain. After the tooth has been extracted, Take the bone graft material out of the freezer and use immediately, not allowing it to thaw. This will maintain the density of the petals for ease of application. Open the pouch and keep the graft material in the sterile bag. The graft material is contained in a flexible, medical grade silicone tray. As you can see, the tray is flexed while in the bag to loosen the petals from the tray and to prevent dropping the material. The bag is then opened and the tray is placed on the operating table. As you can see, the petals have a pointed end and a blunt end. Pick up the pedal with cotton pliers at the blunt end and place it into the extraction socket. Use a bone graft packer to press the graft material into the socket. As the pedal contacts the bone, it melts and fills the root system with chilled graft material. Your assistant continues to deliver the petals to the graft site as the graft material is packed into the socket. Be sure to locate the top of the crest before you pack the socket. If you overpack and fill the gingiva, you are not only wasting material, but also creating an unstable surface for the membrane that is used to cover the graft. Socket graft putty is intended to be used when all four bony walls are intact after extraction. However, when there are missing walls, we recommend using Socket Graft Plus, which is provided in the same delivery system as Socket Graft Putty. Socket Graft Plus contains our third generation beta tricalcium phosphate granules, which helps maintain socket structure, but can also be used for all socket grafting situations. This concludes the real time demonstration of the ease of application. Now we will review the product's performance radiographically to show its effectiveness. In this image, a significant vertical fracture is obvious through the crown and down the mesial root. The tooth was extracted and grafted with socket graft putty and covered with a Teflon membrane. Avoid overfilling into the gingival margin to prevent the membrane from becoming loose during the healing process. This radiograph was taken two weeks after extraction and grafting. Socket graft putty possesses a unique composition of soluble and insoluble properties. The matrix becomes porous after several days as the soluble component washes out. This revolutionary porous matrix allows for rapid migration of mesenchymal stem cells and osteoblasts into the graft material. 
In this radiograph, you can see the roots are filled with mineralized bone. At two weeks and around the coronal portion of the socket, you can see bone growing into the remaining graft material coronal to the roots. This radiograph was taken six weeks after grafting. You can see that the matrix in the coronal portion of the extraction socket is now mineralized, including the crest. In only eight weeks, this extraction socket will be ready for implant placement. Our socket graft putty is the only graft material the FDA has cleared for implant placement eight weeks after grafting. It is the only bone graft material on the market that can truly stimulate osteogenesis. In addition, a study of 100 consecutive implants showed 100% integration and 100% success after three years. If you are new to this product, we suggest you wait 12 weeks for implant placement. This will allow you to gain experience with the material before trying early implant placement. Mahalo nui loa and thank you. I hope this video has made you just as excited as we are about this revolutionary technology. If you have any questions on how this or any of our other innovative products can help your patients, I encourage you to contact me directly. Together we can discuss which product is best for your case and introduce this regenerative technology into your practice.